you know, they've been dumping this polluted water with fungicides, herbicides, pesticides for 40 years, and nothing ever happens. It's the same thing. It destroys our fishing. It gets so bad they put up signs that say high bacteria count, do not wade in the water, do not fish, you know, and it's been going on since I can remember, and it seems like we can't do anything about it. I guess we just don't know the right people, so we just have to put up with this until they lock the gates up on us. So that's about all I have to say. So I've, I've been here fishing off these bridges since 62, and I remember when it used to be clean and green and good fishing, and but now it's all changed. But what do you do? You talk to them about it, and nothing ever happens. Just we have a group of people right here in, you know, in Martin County, the Rivers and, Coalition. Yeah, and Henry at the Snook Nook, he's good. He's always trying to fight it. He knows the right people, but uh, we just don't know. The, uh, don't have uh, the people that control this water being released. You know, it's just not here in. Port St. Lucie, it's around Fort Myers on the west coast, too. They won't let the water go south. Yeah, the Caloosahatchee. Yeah, the Caloosahatchee it releases over, and they have the same problem we have. Well, you know, over here, they put up those signs, all that bacteria, some of it's pathogenic bacteria. It's, you know, it's bad, bad, bad. So, I don't know. In my lifetime, I don't think nothing will ever happen. It's just something we have to put up during the rainy season. So, yeah. all right, my name is Cliff Cook, and I'm speaking up for the St. Lucie. All right. We'd like to see the day when they change it, get the clean water again, so we can all start, you know, good fishing. So, see what happens. And, uh, that's about all I have to say, really. My name is Joe, and I fish here nearly every day. Like it stays that way. Until they stop this discharge and it won't change. So we're sucking wind, you know? Right. My name is Joe and I'm speaking up for the St. Lucie. It's a sad situation. My name's uh, Bart Phillips. I've been fishing this river for about oh, 25, 30 years. And uh, Every year, the water quality from all the water letting uh, discharging from Lake Okeechobee is uh, is just destroying the river. Uh, you know, there's not much to say, but just hope hope they can do something about that discharge from uh, the lake, making to make everything better because we can't hardly catch any fish anymore right now. Before we were catching a lot, a lot of fish. But now that they're discharging water, there's hardly any fish around anymore from the fresh water. My name is uh, Bart Phillips, and I am speaking up for the St. Lucia. But right now, from that bridge to the North Bridge in Fort Pierce, is the cleanest of the Smoke River. On the other side, going back towards the Roosevelt, I don't even go over there anymore because it's so cool. And we're tired of it every time. Time somebody done something about it. And who? I don't know. All right. Big enough for the St. Lucie people and the St. Lucie people. I wish you would send the, the water to Everglades because, man, you ruined the water up here. My name is Buddy Rising and I'm speaking up for St. Lucie.